Hey everybody, and welcome back to Okami. In the last part, uh, we explored some of Taka Pass, and it saw Kusa Village. Which is not in a good way right now. I mean, we, we helped it a little bit by, by saving the priestess. Except there's a monster at the shrine in Kusa Village. And the only way to open it is by gathering up uh, the can some canine warriors. But first, I forgot something in Agata Forest. Oh, uh... I did a thing, I'll it's I will explain that just a second. Here, here. Uh oh. Oh. I had I hold the button, dude. Come on. Okay, yeah, I forgot this up here. I thought I was done and and uh Okay. I I already can't speak. I'm, I thought I was done and got the forest, but I wasn't. Because up here is another stray bead. Okay, and I think that actually should be all of them. I saw on here I was might have been missing one. No, I'm still missing half of them. Well, I will find them later. Maybe I'll look it up in a guide. No, 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 no. Oh, I just. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot about this too. Yeah, there's a little path back here. And if we restore it, like so, yeah, there's a bud back here, and we bloom it, and, no. Oh, well, heck, I thought there was another stray bead back here that I totally forgot about. Well, yeah, we're missing half of them in a Gata Forest, and I... Could not for the life of you tell them tell you where they are. Well. Anyways, okay, so now we're gonna head back to Kusa Village. I will see you there. Alright, we're back in, in Kusa Village. By the way, I didn't get any of the canine warriors here, obviously, because the tractor's going off. If you try to leave, uh Eastern scalds you. Or scolds you, whatever. I I can't say words. Anyways, well, the tracker's pointing me that way, but I already know that one of them is over here. Uh, hi there, little miss. Hello, little doggy. This flower bed used to be really pretty, you know. It was full of flowers and all thriving on the fountain water. But then the wind stopped, and the water dried up, and now... But I'm watering them every day. I have to get them blooming again. Oh, again? Uh, okay. Well, don't worry, little miss. We'll help you out. No need to water them ever again. I mean, you probably shouldn't. Hey, there's a doggy. That's one of the canine warriors we have been sent to find. Uh, uh, Princess Fuse? I, I think that's her name. She said there's five in the village. So, hey, we'll talk to you. What's a dog doing here? Hmm? I think he's trying to say something. Listen carefully. I can understand some animals. I I'm a wolf. I can understand them anyway. It's wagging its tail. But it's that canine tractor you got there. Hmm? What's that? Give me some food. I'm hungry. Sheesh. What is met? And it's begging for food? What terrible manners. Alright. Uh, do I not have any... I got meat, dude. Oh, okay. Well. Okay, now you're probably wondering how do you even give him food? Here, like this. Uh, yeah, that might. I'm sure that's probably gonna trip some of you up, even thinking to do that. Because normally you just press the A button to, to feed animals. But you kind of have to just. I don't know how you would think to go into the menu to do that, but that's how you do that. I am full. My master, Princess Fuse, okay, I got her name right, has summoned me. However, I didn't want to go straight home. You hear that, Ami? That means this dot's one of those so one of those Satomi Canine Warriors. Okay. Also, note his design. He's a dog. He's wearing a scarf, held in place by an orb. Where else, have, where else have we seen that? I'll have to think about that one. In the meantime, uh, we're gonna go find the rest of them. 
Alright, off you go. Okay, so let's see. Uh, um, I, I think there's something in there I need to get later. Uh, we can we can take care of that uh, later on. Um, oh, hi! I just... Oh, yeah. Keep, yeah, keep sleeping there, uh, Susano. I'm sure you'll get a lot done that way. I'm sorry. Keep meditating there, Susano. Oh, and as Ami does a black flip... Yeah, let me explain that. Off screen, I went and purchased the rest of the moves from the dojo. And... One of those moves is dodging around like this. I can do, I can do like side hops like that. Um, we can backflip. Um, I guess you would consider it this game's equivalent of the dodge roll. Um, that's the first thing that comes to mind anyway. I mean Zelda. I mean Zelda does have dodge rolls, I guess. Well, I guess Link just rolls around. Uh, well, anyways, alright, the canine tracker is trying to point us, uh, towards this way. Uh, but first, I want to dig up this clover. I drew the sun instead, okay. Well, hey, that might help bloom this. Uh, although the sun being that close uh, could, is kind of dangerous. Uh, oh, we got a little, uh, well, I want to say raccoons, but I guess these would be tanukis. You like me? Yeah, they do. I mean, I know tanuk Tanukis are not real animals, but then again, I'm playing as a god, so... Hi there! Yeah, I actually do want to talk to you. I want to continue your side quest. Yeah, let's just do that real quick. Yeah. Okay, so let's take care of these guys. Uh, Alright, that should be it. Nice. Alright, dude, how long did that take? Humans are not witness to such battles, but I saw it. The fighting went on for exactly 12 seconds. Hmm. You fight well. I may have devoted myself to following the path of Buddha, but your divine power is still always a delight to behold. Thank you. That's not the last time you have to do that. I forget how many times you have to do that, though. Okay. I, oh, okay, what the heck? Okay, what is going on? I guess, it's, hang on, is there something wrong with my settings? Uh, hang on. No? Motion controls are off. Okay, I... Okay, I didn't... Okay, to dodge with the, in the Nintendo Switch version, I press ZL on my per controller. I did not press that. I promise you I did not press that. It just did it on its own. Is there something up with this controller? I mean, I, I, mean, I bought a second one. Uh, for, uh, well, I'm actually, well, I may as well, while we, while we help out this dog, I'm gonna tell you something right now. Um, by the time you see this video, um, I'm actually gonna be pretty much moved in into my new apartment. Yeah, because I'm actually living, I'm gonna be living on my own, like, literally by myself in a place of my own for the first time in my life. Uh, if you want to know more, I have a video, I made a video about that, I'll link to that in the comments. Um, right now I have part, I have up to part 8 recorded. And, uh, you, uh, uh, by the time you see this, I've already, of course, I've already uploaded, uh, parts 6, 7, and 8 on, uh, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, respectively. Of course, as I'm recording this right now, a part eight is in fact the last part I recorded. So I'm getting this. Uh, so I'm recording this right now, so I, so I can have something to go up, you know, the week after. That way, I don't have to keep you guys waiting. So, uh, 
Okay, I forgot I forgot how I gave on this tangent. Really? I I how did I even Okay, I was trying to explain more than just Wow. God, my memory is worse than I, than I thought. It's it I get my memory is worse than I remember. Ha. Huh. Aren't I funny? I, I, I totally forgot how I even got on the engine in the first place. Um, well, anyways, uh, let's continue on, uh, Mr. Bamboo, huh? Oh, what a pickle I'm in. Mm -hmm. Oh, what a cute wolf. I'm in a pickle right now, Wolfie. I'm a craftsman, and I work with bamboo, as you can see. But I can't get to any work... Nah, I can't get to any... I can't get any to work on... I am so horrible with words. Let me try this again. But I can't get any to work on right now. Okay, you know what? In fairness, that's not question it's anyway. Oh, why shouldn't burden you with my problems, Wolfie? Yeah, this is basically Curse of Village's own Mr. Orange. Boy, that must be some big pickle if you're confiding in a wolf. Hey, I'm not just a wolf. Okay, soon. Give us a credit here. Hello there, little sprite. Here to listen to an old man ramble. I always gathered bamboo over on Sasa Sanctuary and talk about it. But I haven't been able to get in there lately. A sparrow clan suddenly closed the entrance off to Sasa Sanctuary. Oh, how do I wish I could craft my bamboo ware. I'm an old man, and it's all I have left. To make matters worse, the festival's just around the corner. I usually sell my work there. But I'm running out of time. Aw, it ain't the end of the world, Gramps. What have we got ourselves to mix up into now, Ami? Oh, who knows. But speaking of bamboo, uh, the canine tracker really likes this bamboo. Uh, okay, I held the R button down for that. What is up with this controller? Well, anyways, let's cut it open. And there's a doggy sleeping inside. How did you even get in there? Uh, hey, wake up. Alright. Alright, uh... Third verse, same as the second and first. Hey, that can't, Hey, that kinda rhymed, but not really. Alright. Oh, no, I need to actually get up close to it. And then feed him. Have some meat. All right, you satisfied now? Thank you. I'll probably put that praise towards something, but I'm not sure what. Yeah, you're full. I mean, kind of like a little Pomeranian. You have the... Okay, it's this... I, maybe it's just this art style, but you have the deadest eyes. Are you, are you secretly dead? I'm not doing another game theory joke. I already I already did that once. Not in this Let's Play. I think I, think I did that in Night in the Woods. Although I'm sure that I'm, I'm, although I'm sure that game is ripe for game theories in the first place. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Maybe Matt Pat should play that game and then do a game theory on it. I mean, it probably won't make any sense, but I'll watch it anyway. It gets too much hate, I feel. Anyways, let's get back to the game. All right, Canine Tracker's pointing me up there. I'll find myself up there. And, um, yeah, there are actually treasures up here that I do need to get. Uh, I see some chickens. Eh, we'll feed them later. Uh, I will feed all of the animals off screen. Don't worry about that if you really are worried. Anyways, let's this open. Uh, no. I thought that was a stray bead in there. But it's beads of another kind, and... Uh, well, I can't jump that far. We'll save it for later. Alright. Oh, you take me, Canine Tracker. You take me through this cave. Oh. This hanging out in here, dude? Okay. Here. That's some meat. Man, you weren't even, like... I mean, I guess you were hiding, but you're, like, in this cave. But it's, it's like your little hideout spot or something? 
Yeah, you satisfied now? Okay. So I got one dog. Uh, two dog. Uh. Uh, hey Ami, how many of the how many of these canine warriors does this make? Maybe we should go. Maybe we should go talk to Princess Fusei now. Yeah, yeah, we did get. Yeah, we. Yeah, that's our cue to go back to talk to her, and that's and that's four of them. I almost forgot about the the uh the one we found that behind that bumble wall. I almost forgot about that one because I would because I talked over that part uh, about uh, about real life stuff. That you probably that you probably care about, maybe you don't. Anyways, all right. Well, we'll go talk to her now. Um. Oh, I see. Thing for another canine warrior. I guess we don't have to find him. Uh, you look mad. What happened to your eye right there? Hey, Ami. That flea bud's giving you the evil eye. But <laughs> yeah, the one evil eye. I think it knows that canine tracker you got there. Hmm? What's that? My master, Princess Fusei, has summoned me. But first, I wish to try out the skills. I've honed my jerk. Yeah, I hear that. Princess Fusei forbids me to join fruitless battles. But I want you to prove your right to bear the canine tracker. Why you... You've got a lot of nerve picking a fight with us. Well, bring on you, flea bag, right, Furball? Uh, right you are, little bug. I oh, can't hurry. Oh, I will pick a fight. Alright. You want to bring it on? Alright, let's bring it on then. Here we go, got ourselves a little mini boss here. Um, Alright, you want to fight? Let's fight. Okay, so I forget his name, but yeah, but when his orb shines like that, he will do a big combo on you, along with along with some cooldown. That's your cue to attack him. No, that's not his only attack though. But this is, but that this is his most annoying. Okay. Um, in fact, I think this might be the only attack he does. Oh, and sometimes he will just do a three attack combo. One that goes far. Oh, and and while that's shining, you can't hurt him. So I think I will do pretty good for damage. Oh, I knocked him out like that. Let's slash him. And he's done for. That's the end of you. How'd I do? What? I mean, I did bad for time. I practically sped... I practically did a speedrun of that fight. A worthy opponent, I see. Let's fight, but we have more room. Uh, you hit. Yeah, I hear that. Okay. Yeah, he's another canine warrior. Uh, and this is Tay. I am done toying with you. Now, shall, now you shall feel the wrath of the Satomi Power Warp. Satomi Power Warp? Bah! Bring your own dog breath, we ain't afraid. Oh, Tay! I thought I heard something out here. You two aren't fighting, are you? Huh? Fighting? Oh, uh, of course not. Just some friendly wrestling. Look, not a scratch on either of us. Too true, I didn't take any damage in that fight. But I did awful for time somehow. Well, at least now we have five Satomi Power Orbs. But you've been naughty doggies. Why did you not come home immediately when I summoned you? Hey, Princess, what's with those Satomi Power Orbs? Each Satomi Canine Warrior bears an orb of a different virtue. <clears throat> the Satomi Power Orbs are the Satomi House's greatest treasure. I need the orb's power to break Crimson Helm's barrier. But the Canine Warriors never listen when I summon them back. And three of them have yet to be accounted for. I fear something may have happened to them. But there is no one I could send out to help them. Uh... Hey, what's with that look, lady? Okay, okay, I get the hint. We'll find the rest of them, too. After all, I said we'd get them all back without a scratch. Wonderful! 
I'll be forever grateful. I know the general locations of the remaining three canine warriors. I shall mark them on your map. Okay. Uh, yeah, two of them we can go, we can literally go get right now. But one of them, uh, takes a little bit of finesse to actually get them. Alright. You have the canine tracker. They shall return here once you have shown it to them. That is, if they had not been injured, or even worse. Please hurry, we must get the power of and break the barrier. Will do, lady. While I'm actually over here, there's a little couple treasures up here. Like this one, for instance. You're not what I was looking for, but I'll take you anyway. I'm going to sell you later. Um, ow. Anyways, uh, more importantly, under here somewhere, if I can find you. Yes, there you are. I believe. Still no. Okay. <clears throat> well, there's a treasure I want that's under the water somewhere. Are you... Okay. If I... Oh, no. Mm, running into things somehow. Are you over here? Okay, well, I'm just totally mistaken then. Wait, no, 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 no. There's... I just barely noticed that. There's treasure in it. And that your look what I was looking for. I know the stray bead. I don't remember how many there are in Kusei Village, but that's definitely one down. Okay, so for those of you who are trying to guess where we've seen a similar design of those dogs. I'm going to pull up the map. Uh, if you guess we saw one in both Kamiki Village and uh, Agatha Forest, you were correct. But hang on. Oh. Who's this? I zoom out. Who's this other dog? That's not an area we've been to. We'll deal with them later. Like I said, it takes a little bit of work to actually get to that area. Um, anyways. <clears throat> so, yeah, so yeah, we do have to go back to uh, uh, Kimiki Village. And there is something, there is one other thing there I completely forgot to do. Uh, maybe I remember those two girls standing by, uh... The Konohana tree. Um, we d it involves them. But anyways, if I'm right, this man can offer us a way uh, there quicker. For all the luck, I wanted to do some trading over at the Gale Shrine. But it's been taken over by some monster. Ugh, it's panic all around. Oh well, I suppose I'll just have to make the best of it now. Uh, you have what I'm looking for, right? Okay, I did not know you had that. Uh, that's another weapon. Also a pinwheel. Uh, I do want to buy that, actually. Also, you have, you have some gold dust, but I... You have more gold dust. You have no more gold dust, okay. And you don't... And you do not actually have the thing I was looking for, okay. Okay, maybe you remember the uh, mermaid fountain we uh, restored in the last part. That girl mentioned that you can throw a mermaid coin in there to go to places. That's, like I said, in the last part, that's our fast travel system. I thought that guy sold mermaid coins. He does not. I don't remember when those unlock. In fact, I thought restoring that mermaid uh, uh, fountain right there would actually unlock that ability. But it doesn't. Well, I have egg on my face for that. Kind of. Well, anyways, uh, these people over here want a pinwheel, and I will give it to them. And I don't know what they give me, but they give me something. Um, so we'll do that. Um, I'm trying to remember how I even got into my real life tangent. God, I don't remember how I did that. Yeah, I have a pinwheel. Yeah, that's why I got it. That's why I have it anyway. 
I don't know, he, he talks about doesn't have to worry about his wife giving him a wallet while she's standing right here. Okay, so they're good. Um, I actually want to upgrade something. Um, let's upgrade our money, actually. Yeah, we can, now we can hold over around 10,000 yen. Yeah, we can hold uh, 99, 99, 99 yen. Just shy of a million. Oh, gimme. Ugh. Timing on that is super terrible. I, I always have trouble with the timing on that. Um, now, granted, uh, the other dog, the one, the one that's of, like, he's, he's practically in the uh, Taka Pass, Taka Pass uh, general area, well, in an area adjacent to it. You might think just getting him, just getting that canine warrior, would be faster. It's not. Um, yeah. I will see you again. Hey, have you seen my dog, Ume? He's always with me when, when I'm fishing. He disappeared while I wasn't looking. You don't think he could have fallen to the deep abyss, could you? Um, I don't know. Oh. Ah, okay, I thought I, was, I thought I was gonna be doing this a lot later, but no, I'm doing it right now. Yeah, so now... Um, uh, Lady of Venus and Hitoshio Spring. What lady? Um, uh, well, uh, the spring, that spring he's referring to is actually up here. It's, it's where I started the part, getting that stray bead. Now... Now, let's see. Um, hi there! I haven't seen you in a while. Mm, the water here is so lovely and cool. Now, time to get to work. Here's the barrel. Hmm? Why, looky here, it's Kushi. What you up to here, sweetie? I won't see you snowy knee soon. I'm here making preparations for the annual Kamiki Festival. I've come to get water for the holy sake we offer to the gods. People say that the water here at Hitoshia Spring has divine powers. We always mix it with the holy sake we use for the festival. That way we can make a purification sake. Whoa, hold it right there, sister. A purification sake? You mean the sacred drink of ancient legend? That's right. It goes back to the legend of Nagi and Shiranui. It was the miraculous sake that they used to defeat Orochi. Apparently, they got the beast drunk and cut off its heads. It certainly smells strong enough to intoxicate anything. I don't know if the legend's really true or not, but we offer sake to the gods at festival time and pray for peace. What else? By the way, sweetie, I was wondering... You plan on filling this barrel with the water? That's right. We need enough for all the villagers. So I have to fill this barrel to the brim. But how are you going to fill such a big barrel with water? And even if you can, how are you going to carry it back to the village? Hmm? That's a good point. I hadn't thought of that because Suzano usually takes care of it. He can handle the barrel as if it was as light as a feather. There's no way I can manage on my own, though. Hmm. Silly girl. Uh, yeah, you... Okay, it's prompting me to do something. I can't do this yet. Actually, finding that other Satomi Canine Warrior near Taka Pass actually will unlock the ability to even deal with that. Okay, I don't want to fight a monster right now. Go away. Okay, well... Um... Well then. Uh... Oh, great. Can I actually not do this yet? Yeah, talk about... Talk about the fish. Uh, 
Okay, I actually do have to help her first. Oh. Dang it. I have to even do more backtracking then. Um. <sighs> okay, I think we do have to take care of the of the canine warrior near Taka Pass, actually. I think he actually does come first. I got, I, it's been a while since I played this game last, like, I mean, like months and months ago. So, I don't remember. I, my memory's a little fuzzy on this, but yes, I do think we have to save him first. I'm going to say save, but, you know, maybe he's fine. Maybe he's living in the lap of luxury. Oh, well, well, uh, we'll just go over there then. Um, no, no, dang it, dang it, dang it. No, 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 no. We can't, no, we can't even do that yet. Because there's a thing to, to even get into the place that I need to get into. I have to do a thing first. And I need an ability to do the thing. I'm trying, I'm being vague as possible, I know. But, yeah. But I need an ability to do the thing to give me the thing that lets me get into the place near Taka Pass. And I don't have that ability. That helping... That uh, help, helping out uh, Ko Kokari will give me that ability. Ah, uh, dang it. Who comes... Dang it. Mm. God, I'm lost. Ugh. Maybe I do need to go to Kamiki Village first, then. Because I can't help Kokari right now. I don't think. Oh, maybe... I don't know. Maybe I, there's something I have to find here first. I, oh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry I'm being vague and I'm being stupid. It's just... I don't have a great memory, you see? Oh, right. I'm glad I'm here because I need to bomb that wall right there. I, th I thank God I just remember that. Well, thank God I just saw that. Yeah, let's go ahead and bomb this. Oh. I was holding the R button game. Oh. oh. Uh. I can't do this yet. <laughs> That's uh, not until way later. <laughs> okay, well, that was pointless. Uh. Not to, not to up to that cat statue, but maybe we'll find out later. Um. Hello. I didn't even. I just barely even noticed you. What's in here? Another stray bead. Well, thank you. I was by total. I was by total happenstance. Uh, can't clue me. And what will you give me? Uh, yeah, wooden bear. Okay. Well, now you something. Uh, yeah, you yeah, take this. Uh, yeah, maybe I do have to do Kamiki Village first. Uh, oh hi there. I think you're his dad. <laughs> Mm, yeah, there's that. Uh, yeah, I may have to do Kamiki Village first. Dang it. Okay. Yeah, like I said, my memory is super spotty with this. Can I talk to you again? Yeah. Um, well, anyways. All right, well, we'll go to Kamiki Village then. God, my, me my memory is terrible. It really is. All right, we're back at Kamiki Village. Oh, yeah, just as predicted. The canine tracker pops up. Whoa, the canine tracker suddenly appeared. So that means uh, yeah. Bet you never would have guessed it. Yeah. 
How long are you planning to just sit there? You remind me of a certain statue I saw somewhere. Is that the canine tracker? Yeah, you never would have guessed Hayabusa was like... This random little dog was important, would you? Have you come to take me back to my master? You hear that, Ami? You must be on an errand from Princess Fuse if you bear that. We should not move from here. The festival will begin soon. You lazy little mutt. You're gonna come with me whether you like it or not. Also, his actual name is Chu. You gotta be kidding me. You wanted the Satomi Kanai Warriors? And you're ignoring the princess's summons to wait for the festival? Come back here tonight. We need to have a man to man talk. Man to man talk? Don't you mean dog to wolf? Uh, so yeah, we have to wait for night. God, I want. Mm, I really, really want to do the thing with Kukari, because then I can. Heck, okay, I'm just going to spoil it. Yeah, I'm sorry if you don't like spoilers, I don't care. Yeah, and doing that would make this a lot easier if I could just turn day to night and also let me do the thing I need to do to get into the place near Taka Pass. But I don't think I can do the thing if, if I can't help Kokari out if I can't get... But I can't... Ugh. Like, I can't... I'm fr look, I'm frustrated. And I, and I wouldn't be so frustrated if I could actually remember the proper order of things. Oh, hi there. Cut this down. What do you get? What do you got for me? Um, a golden peach. Okay, yeah. This feels it, the astral pound instantaneously. But I'm back up here now. I want to talk to these two again. Trees bursting out when leaves and flowers? Weird things only, like that only happen in dreams. If someone will just hit me, I'll wake up from it. Yeah. Well, ask and you shall receive. Ouch! Huh? Am I so dreamy? So, flowers really did just burst out all over this tree? But it can't be. Surely miracles don't really happen. Do they? Oh, you'd be surprised. That takes care of them, then. And so, they have a... They have a they have an extended side quest, and that's just one part of it. Well, anyways, uh, okay, uh, it's turning to it's it's turning to night now, so we'll wait until it does that, and then we'll talk to Hayabusa. Oh, I'm sorry, Chew. Hayabusa is a bit, Hayabusa is a, a more awesome name. Oh, um, uh, seems I won't have to wait that long, guy. I, I thought it was, I thought. You know, I thought I was gonna have to cut, but I may not have to. I may not have to do that. Or, uh, okay, maybe I might have to. Uh, please turn tonight. Please. You want? You want to turn tonight? Am I actually gonna have to cut here? Uh. Alright, you know what, future me? Uh just go just go ahead and cut when I said when I thought I was gonna have to cut earlier. Okay, thanks. Hmm. I really thought I was gonna have to uh cut uh earlier. Is this a tune? Yeah, there we go. Alright, now it's night. Alright, let's go talk to him. You bear the canine tracker, so you must know what it decrees. Men sell the differences at night. Man to man, fist to fist. Man to man, fist to fist? Do you mean dog to wolf, paw to paw? You gonna let this punk talk to you like that, Ami? Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> oh, I'll pull your reference to that. Alright, so now we gotta fight Chu. 
I prefer Hayabusa, so I'm gonna call him Hayabusa. Oh, uh, you weren't meant, you were not meant to see the thing that was on the left of that scroll right there. That's, that's a bit of a spoiler. Okay, so Hayabusa, I'm, I'm not calling him Chew. He fights, he fights more or less the same that that Tay does. Be, but he also did a hole to do damage to you. Also, don't go in that hole, you'll get trapped. Here. That's the main reason he does that anyway. Uh, yeah, the debris, yes, yes, the debris from him digging the hole uh, will do damage and you can't be trapped in it. Um, also, one of the other attacks he does when shining the orb is that he'll do a long, he'll do a long run, like you saw there. How, how'd that reach me? Much like that, actually. Yeah, I thought so. Slash. Oh, I don't want to bloom flowers. I ain't, I'm saying all roses right now. Ow! Here, you know what? Have a bomb. Ha ha ha. That's it. Now, can I bomb you again? Maybe somehow get a demon thing? You're not a demon. Why would, why would that even work? Uh, I did bear for time on that. If only I hadn't taken damage there. Okay, you got some explaining to do, Fleabag. Why are you ignoring the princess to summons to wait for the festival? I am not the real Hayabusa. Oh! The real Hayabusa died along with Mushi's father when they were attacked by monsters deep in the forest. I happened to pass by about that time, but I was too late. Right before Hayabusa died, she begged me to protect Mushi. She foretold the coming of an evil arrow from the sky. An arrow that would kill Mushi on the night of the full moon. That is how I came to live here in this village. I have been waiting for the full moon of the festival season. Nobody knows I was not the real Hayabusa as we are the same breed. The night of the full moon draws near. I shall not move from here. My duty is to fulfill Hayabusa's dying wish. I must protect Mushi. Aww. Oh, but wait. Ah, you may not have to worry about that because the orb's gonna come to me anyway. That's awesome. I got the loyalty orb. How fitting. Guys, so tell me power ward, Ami. What was the, what was all that she said? What was all that? Okay, I can see. An arrow that killed. Uh, yeah, I don't like the sound of that. I hope it's not related to that legend about Rochi and the arrow. Me neither. Uh, did I never? Hang on, did I never get that treasure chest? I never got this treasure chest. Are you serious? I, I thought I got. Really? Okay. Serious? Oh. Uh. Well, it's nothing to worry about then. Hmm. Um. I just realized I actually can do the thing for Taka Pass. Getting it to open up. I don't need the Moonrise ability, actually. It certainly makes it easier. But I don't actually need it. Yeah. Yeah, what am I... Th oh, oh, yeah, by the way, at night, you can actually see some of the constellations that you made. Yeah. Like that one, actually. Yeah, I didn't, th yeah, I didn't think I was going to get to show that. But, yeah, that's pretty cool, actually. Kind of gives you a little reminder of, of how far you've come in this game. Oh. What? Whoa, where are you going? Whoa, hang on now, dude. Hold the phone. Phew, I'm firing all snowmers again today. So, what do you want? Let's put the twinkle on your eye, Pooch. You want to race? Now I can do this. I thought I couldn't do it. Okay, now I can do this. Uh, I guess we're doing this now. Ready? Go. Okay. Is... Like, like with most races in a video game, cut them off at the pass. Okay. Uh, yeah, so now I get to do this. Okay. So, yeah, we're just gonna do this. Oh. Yeah. So, I should have mentioned. Don't get too ahead of him. 
because then you're just going to start over. So yeah, be better than him, but don't be too good. Yeah, yeah, you want to, yeah, you do want to, yeah, again. Try to stay ahead of him, but don't stay too ahead. That's really stupid, I think. I think you should be able to cut him off as much as you want, but... Uh... No, uh, the game doesn't want you to do that. Oh, and don't attack him either. Because then, because then that also makes you have to restart the fight. The fight? No, the race. So yeah, two rules for this. Uh, don't cut him off, don't get too ahead of him, and don't attack him. Again, that's pretty stupid. But, you know, you have to deal with it. Okay. And of course, you do have to deal with the demon skulls. Um, oh, ooh, maybe uh, the unnamed guy right there. Maybe I can actually do his thing now. I'm not sure, though. Uh, oh, God. Oh, I got, like, all sorts of things floating around in my mind that I probably need to do. Uh. Oh, no, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. And... Uh. Is that it? No! Ah, yeah, stupid demon scrolls, I swear. Yeah, if you do that, if that happens, you gotta start the race again. Yeah, I was afraid of that. And you, and I think that is a three lap race you have to do. Ah, well, I thought I was gonna get to do that, but nope. There is an item that will keep away demon scrolls, of course. Uh, if I had known I could even do that race right now, I would have, I would have bought that item, but I didn't. Oh well, we'll take care of that some other time. Anyways, let's actually go back to Taka Pass now. I'm gonna meet you guys back in Taka Pass in part ten.